All life on Earth is possible only because of one celestial body, the Sun. From weather patterns that benefit and sustain life on our planet, to the very plants that living organisms depend upon for oxygen, all these require the Sun's powerful rays to function normally. But what if this life giver suddenly turned into a life destroyer? What would happen if the Sun suddenly became the most destructive force in this galaxy, a black hole? Would the Earth be sucked in, or would life on our planet be able to continue? Could we still rely on the Sun's gravity, or would everything be thrown into chaos? The idea of the Sun transforming into a black hole might sound like science fiction, but it raises fascinating questions about the nature of our universe. While black holes are often depicted as cosmic monsters that devour everything in their path, the true consequences of such a transformation might surprise you. Welcome to Lab 360. It's time to explore. If the Sun were to suddenly become a black hole, the consequences for our solar system would be both fascinating and catastrophic, though not in the way one might initially think. While the transformation of the Sun into a black hole would have a dramatic effect on the Sun itself, it would not immediately destroy the Earth or other planets. The transformation would occur without an explosion, with the Sun collapsing inward under the force of its own gravity, compressing all of its mass into an incredibly small, dense point known as a singularity. The gravitational pull around this singularity would be extreme, but the size of the Sun would change drastically. It would shrink to an incredibly tiny point, but its mass would remain unchanged. One of the most crucial aspects of the transformation is that the mass of the Sun, which remains constant, would still exert the same gravitational pull as before. The key difference, however, is that the Sun's gravitational field would now be concentrated in a point at the center of the black hole. For the planets, this means that they would continue to orbit this point of intense gravity, exactly as they do around the current Sun, the Earth and other planets would continue orbiting the black hole in much the same way they orbit the Sun today. The gravitational force that holds the planets in their orbits is determined by the Sun's mass, not its size or the nature of its transformation. So, the Earth's orbit would remain unchanged in terms of path and stability. The orbit would not spiral inward or outward, and the planets would not be flung off into space. While the planets would not be affected by the Sun's collapse in terms of their orbits, they would be drastically affected by the loss of light and heat. The Sun, as a black hole, would no longer emit the vast quantities of light and heat that sustain life on Earth. The lack of sunlight would quickly plunge the Earth into darkness, with temperatures rapidly dropping. On Earth, temperatures would fall dramatically. Within days, the average global temperature could plummet to minus 73 degrees Celsius or minus 100 degrees Fahrenheit, causing the oceans to freeze. Over time, the atmosphere would also cool and the planet would become an inhospitable ice ball. Without sunlight, photosynthesis would cease, leading to the collapse of ecosystems. Life on Earth, as we know it, would be unable to survive. Without the sun's energy, life would not survive long on Earth. Over time, the planet would freeze entirely and the atmosphere would eventually collapse, becoming a thin, lifeless shell. Any remaining life would likely perish within months to years. Artificial energy sources, such as nuclear fusion reactors, could potentially provide power for a while, but they would not be able to stave off the inevitable collapse of ecosystems and the planet's habitability. On a longer scale, the absence of the sun's energy would also impact the dynamics of the solar system in other ways. The gravitational balance of the system could eventually be disturbed, and the black hole's immense gravity could lead to interactions with nearby objects, such as asteroids or comets, potentially altering orbits over time. So this by far would be the most catastrophic effect of the sun becoming a black hole. But moving forward, one of the most significant features of a black hole is its event horizon, the point beyond which nothing, not even light, can escape. If the sun were to become a black hole, the event horizon would form at a radius of about 1.86 miles. 
which is much smaller than the current radius of the Sun, about 432,690 miles. This means that the Sun's outer layers would collapse into this tiny point, but the Earth, still in its orbit at a distance of around 93 million miles, would remain well outside the event horizon. Therefore, no matter what happens to the Sun's core, the Earth would not be sucked into the black hole, as some might imagine. We would not experience the dramatic effects of crossing the event horizon unless we got incredibly close, which would be far beyond the Earth's orbit. While the black hole itself might seem like a terrifying and destructive force, its true impact would be felt not through its gravitational pull, but through its inability to sustain life on Earth. In the end, while the Earth would continue orbiting the sun-turned black hole, life as we know it would cease without the warmth and light we rely on. The cosmic transformation might leave our solar system intact, but the absence of sunlight would plunge our planet into an irreversible, frozen silence. Could life on Earth in the form of organisms and bacteria even survive such a dark, lifeless future? Sound off in the comments below and don't forget to subscribe to the channel for the latest revelations in space exploration. Hit the bell icon to stay updated and let's continue to explore together.